Super Mario Galaxy playthrough, and as it turns out, we actually have all of the mushrooms inside of the engine room. I don't actually think I remember them bringing us down here when we got the ghost one. Maybe they did and I just totally forgot, I don't really know. But as it turns out, I don't really get a whole lot of anything for getting those. Uh, that Luma just said, oh you got them all, now I have to brag to everybody. And I'm just like, yeah, yeah, alrighty. Jeez, my volume's pretty loud there. Let me turn down my speakers, okay. Now let's go on over here and com uh, complete Bowser Jr.'s Boom Bunker. So I think I remember this boss. I think we have to use Cloud Mario to jump up and ground pound him or something. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out when we get there. Yep, that looks exactly like what we got to do. Okay, so I think this one's pretty fun. Hopefully... Oh, this is his... <laughs> this is his uh, Mega Leg or whatever it was that we dealt with last time. Crashed here. That's pretty cool. Don't worry, it's broken. Yeah, I bet you do, Toads. You're all kind of useless anyway. Yeah, oh dear. You said it was broken, Toad. There's still bullet bills coming out of it. Alright. Ouch. I didn't even notice that this thing was right here. So let's see if I knock that off the edge. Yes, I do. Okay, and away it goes. <laughs> Alrighty. I think it spawned a mushroom. Oh, darn it, I need the bullet bill. Okay. Come here, bullet bill. Come here. I need your services. You gotta blow up these things. There we go. Oh, and we get to use a cannon. We haven't done this in a while. So I think I could probably aim for them. I think that'd be fine. But let's go for the target, which is what we're supposed to go for. Get a one up if you get right smack in the bullseye. And now we gotta deal with Boomerang Brothers. These guys are significantly less annoying than Hammer Brothers because their boomerangs move way slower than the hammers do. And I also saw a health- whoa! Mushroom, I think, so let's... Pick that up. Did I see one? I could, oh, there it is. Okay, I did see one. That's some pretty cool pole vaulting there, uh... Mario, although I don't really know if I'd call that pole vaulting anyway. That's not exactly pole vaulting, but he is a pretty good gymnast. I mean, come on. Could you do any of the stuff he does? Probably not. Let's see if I get the bullseye on this one. I don't think I'm quite gonna get it. Oh, I did. Well, it counted anyway. Okay. Oh, that's gonna kill me. I'm an idiot. I shouldn't have shaken there. I don't know why I'm really getting bad at jumping onto these other platforms these days. <laughs> and I lose my health mushroom. So what a great use that was. Well, I see why they give you a one-up when you go for a bullseye there. Okay, there's a star coin. That's good. I probably would have missed that too. So let's go. Let's go grab... The okay, that time Mario didn't jump. That wasn't my fault. <laughs> what the heck? You know, I swear when I played through this on my first ever time, I didn't die nearly as much as I'm dying in this playthrough, but I think I had just finished playing Super Mario Galaxy 1 when this game came out, so I might have been, you know, I, I might have been way more used to the controls than I am right now. Okay. Got it. That is an improvement, so now we need Cloud Mario. Ground pounder way down here, and off we go. Still got two clouds with us. Are we already at the boss? Looks like we are. I'm surprised that there wasn't a Luma to give me a health mushroom, but okay, I guess we can deal with this. I don't think this guy's too hard. Oh, 
Oh dear. Alrighty, well. Let's get up here. I think his things can, like, destroy my clouds. Yes, they can. Oh, jeez. I can even destroy the other clouds that are just sitting here. Okay, so let's do that. Get over here. And now he's gonna freak out a little bit, like, What are you doing on top of my machine? Get off of there, Mario. Alright. He's gonna get a little bit angry. Send all kinds of stuff after me. Or, I guess, I, okay. I think he's just gonna electrocute himself every now and then, so you can't really jump on him. Oh, you need the long jump there, Mario. There we go. So I don't know if he gets bigger or not because there's clouds that are higher up. Yes, he does. And now I think he actually moves around. So let's pick up this cloud if I can do it without getting hit. <laughs> Holy dear goodness. Oh dear goodness, what the heck. Alright, well. I guess I can just climb on top of him. I mean, what else am I going to do? Let's go pick up a cloud though. Okay. Oh, got it. I'm a little bit surprised that hit. Okay, that's good. I think that was actually one of the shorter Grand Star levels. I mean, there really wasn't much between the boss, and then the boss himself wasn't even that big of a deal. But there is our fifth Grand Star, and also somewhat the completion, if you want to call it completion, the completion of uh, World 5. Alright, so World 6 is actually kind of lengthy, it seems. 1800 dang star bits, and I still haven't even freed the Luma or fed the Luma in the previous world. So anyway, next one will be Melty Monster Galaxy. That'll be done in the next video, though. So that'll be it for this video, and I will continue on in the next part.